Hello, Hello Floss Tube. We're the Real Housewives of Cross Stitch. I'm Priscilla. And I'm Chelsea. And she's already showing her butt. <laughs> no, you can see the dust flying. Because it's so sunny. Hold on. The dust where? There we go. On like your phone? In the air. I don't know. In the air. Oh my gosh. Can you see it? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, well, we're just going to be floating in that. We are filming at a different time than normal, so... <laughs> That's, <laughs> that's what's going on right now. We, She's like, do you have any push bins so we can get some? We can put like out? a sheet, sheet up. The sun is right here. So normally, I mean, we don't, we film early in the morning. We're doing it in the afternoon now and the sun is right there. But we did this last week too, didn't we? Or with day. a wedding or something? We did it around the same time. My flowers are still alive. My flowers are still alive. <laughs> same. <laughs> Than a I need to get my dahlias out. I think I need to get those out. We haven't been doing anything. So update: Cash's surgery went well. Um, we yeah. got him home, and then what? I don't know. However many days. Sunday. It's Sunday. Sunday. Right. It's always on a weekend. Always. He came home Friday. Came home Friday. Seemed Sunday. Pretty good. Seemed pretty right. good. I he saw him full Friday of energy. Night. He was good. But, but then, then it's been. <laughs> yeah, high fevers. High fever. You know he's notoriously. He's notorious for high fevers, um, but we called Children's and we're like, they said to get him into uh, a hospital. So we took him to the one right by our house and they did some tests. They did a, an x-ray to make sure that he didn't have pneumonia because of the breathing tube, blah, blah, blah. Uh, they did find like a viral infection is what she said. So he did get something or had something beforehand. You know, he was on an antibiotic and then we took him off of that once the surgery happened. So yada, yada. He's okay. He's got a fever still, which is normal. Um, but it's fine. They're not looking, but, um, we're just taking it day by day. The scabs have not started yet, which they should have already I th from the internet standards. So I hear that that's very painful. He's in pain. Um, but he's, he's got such good spirits. So keep your prayers coming. I mean, nothing life-threatening or anything like that he's in good spirits but he's just ugh, through the ringer and we do alternating ibuprofen and um motrin. acetaminophen whatever yeah whatever those are um motrin and tylenol every three hours so i have not slept since i don't know i'm tired um tired. Probably last tuesday right because i was so anxious about the surgery the surgery took like 25 minutes like they text you now they <laughs> update you and they're like oh he's out oh where you've done the ear tubes oh we're moving on to the tats oh adenoids are up i guess they had to clear out a lot of stuff in his ears he can hear a little bit better so there's this ninja <laughs> kid song and he thought that it was a bad word in it and i mean he fights us every time we put it on and he's like no they say a bad word blah 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 and then we're driving home and he said they say front flip <laughs> They don't say a bad word. It was like an epiphany. So they, not only are they great for infections going forward, but maybe they're going to help them here a little bit better. All right. Uh, other than that, this week, you are getting ready. You're going mm -hmm. to... I'm going to Virginia. Virginia. Roanoke, Virginia. She was supposed to go with, but she can't because of cash. So, yep, so she's on my own. Solo again. <laughs> <laughs> this time it was pre-planned that she would be solo because it was so close to his recovery dates. Um... So it's not like the Indiana where she's going to whip in and, and just <laughs> tell everyone that I left or that kind of thing. So, well, I'm tell them that <laughs> so no, I'm just kidding. She's excited for that. She got the itinerary. I don't even know when a day ago or two days ago. And it looks like it's going to be a lot of fun. Mm -hmm. She got her hair done today. Yep. <laughs> they didn't fix it or anything. So she ran in here. Let me blow dry it. <laughs> um, what else have you done? No, you went to my, my, nobody fixes my hair like I like it. So yeah, it's, it's not. I'm gonna sit. My throat is parched. I haven't talked this <laughs> much in a while. What do you? What have you? You went to football? Yes, I went to football last week. They won both of their games, and now they're in the playoffs. And I'm gonna miss them on Saturday, but if they win, then they'll be in the Super Bowl, which will be the following week. So I'll be home. That's good. And then we have another retreat after that. We go to oh. North Carolina. Okay, so I just need to tell the story real quick before I forget it. We were sitting in the waiting room. They don't have you wait in like his room. They have you wait out in the hallway. And we wait. Then me and Papa get to go back to his room because he's waking up. No, no, baby. And, um, okay. Um, that was Presley. We go back into the room where he's just waking up. And we're in there for a couple minutes. You know, I'm soothing him. And then somebody pops their head in. And they're like, are you? And there's 
before he even said it, I, I don't know why. I, he's like, I saw your bag. I was like, yes. So I get, he, his mom is a stitcher. I, my brain is mush, but I believe her name is Vicky and his name was Jacob. If I'm totally wrong, I'm so sorry. But he said, you're going to poop your pants if I said hi to you today. So <laughs> hi, hello. Um, we got a selfie and I was so excited to like, just like a little relief because I was so stressed going in there, your baby on morphine and everything. Ugh, gross. Okay. But hi, hello, hello. You see people everywhere. All right. Um, okay. Questions. We had questions last week. Jackie wanted to know, Chelsea, I love your glasses frames. Any chance you can share where you got them? Um, these are called Varda and I buy all my glasses on I buy direct. They're like 30 to $50 and pardon you. Um, <laughs> she's going home with Chelsea today. She's going she to, doesn't know she's that. going to the farm. <laughs> she um, doesn't know that. <laughs> She's gonna be so excited. We're gonna have walks around the pond. Everything. It's gonna be so enlightening. Ronnie's for you. going with Chelsea too, and Hunter's taking Presley. Yes. Hunter and Destiny have Presley. I would take Presley, but with Cash being, she's too wild. Yeah. <laughs> um, but I buy direct, so E Y E buy direct, and then you just put in your your prescription thing. Okay. Monica, on the finish for Antoine, good night. What size sticky board do you use? Do you cut the board and piece it together? I don't know what the size was, but I don't remember having to piece that one together because they make 16 by 20 inch. Yeah, that's not pieced together. They make 16 by 20 inch sticky boards, so you can just cut a piece off of that. Yeah. Mary, will you come out with a Christmas town and an Easter town? I guess you're just going to have to stay tuned. <laughs> I already have names. Um, Sandra, how far apart do you live from each other? It's about 25 minutes. Mom will say it's an hour. It's about 25 minutes. It's like 23 to 25 for me. Um, it, we're like right in the middle of the highway or 45 so she can get either way. It's yeah. Kinda nice. Well, while they were at the hospital, I was doing the dogs. <laughs> yeah. She <laughs> let our dogs out for Cause my dog sitter wasn't available. She said she was going out. So I, I go in there and the cats corner me. <laughs> There's like a herd of them. And then when I go to leave, the chickens corner my car so I can't get out. And when I went to leave the first time, the house on the corner was in fire, on fire here. It oh was, yeah. It was pouring out the garage. And I was like, <laughs> oh my God. A lot. I know I couldn't get out of the neighborhood, so I had to drive all the way around. And then I got home, and their lights were on upstairs, and they were in the house. It was just like a fire on the car in the garage. It was the weirdest thing ever. And it wasn't a Tesla. Um, yes, she got cornered by the chickens, and she has like PTSD from when she was a kid and chickens. Um, so you can watch our previous videos to hear all about that. She used to have to tie rags around her ankles. I did not tie rags around my ankles. I was a small child. They oh. would wrap washcloths around my ankles and to put a rubber band on it to hold it. So that would cut off my circulation because the chicken had to peck my ankles. It they had rooster. Rooster. Yeah, they had rooster. I don't have, thank goodness. Oh, and we have a few roosters, or a few hens laying eggs. So Cash gets to go out there and get his eggs every day. But we don't have roosters. Thank goodness. We didn't get any. But Chelsea they had did. grown a watermelon in her garden oh. and it was just sitting there and, you know, it's cold and all of her other stuff is frozen. Dead. And I was like, why shouldn't the chickens get this? So I she went and I took it. it and I threw it on the ground. So then they all ran to the watermelon. So she <laughs> could get out. Because they'll sit behind your tires. They don't care. They don't move. And it's always the Chelsea chickens. They just sit there. And, just, and, and oh. the one white duck. Yeah. That's, uh, no, Mario. That's Mario. Well, he was a pain in the butt. <laughs> She's... Sandra, how far apart? Oh, no, sorry. Marsha, what size sticky circle do you use for finishing the month to month button? So the button you use, these three and a half inch. Yep, I used one of those today and it was so nice not having to cut it, but I did have to cut the backing one because we don't have ones big enough for that. Yeah, we'll show you Kimberly. what we mean. Kimberly. <laughs> uh, red poppy. Oh, if you, the shirts went in stock yep, this week. Yeah, the shirts are in stock. I have it on, but I'm, it's fine. Um, mine's in my suitcase. Red Poppy Crafts. I love the Halloween banner. Are there going to be more banners for all our holidays and seasons? Y'all well, are You guys so... know that, that, you know. <laughs> we can't just do one or something. We <laughs> yeah. always got to have a it's series. It's like a Ray Dunn cup. There's got to be 500. A series <laughs> inside of a series. A sub-series. <laughs> <laughs> That's what it is. This stuff is nasty, but I'm trying not to drink Diet Coke. So nasty. Edwina, Priscilla, where did you buy the barn? That barn. Hobby Lobby. I don't know if they have the white one still, but they do have a brown one. You can always stain it. And I think they come out with them in red, too. That'd be fun for Christmas. Mm -hmm. 
You better get your Christmas stuff now. It'll all be sold out before then. Oh, now you want me to pet you. Okay, that's all the questions I have for this week. <laughs> There's like five of the, are you going to have a Halloween town? Are you going to have a different town? Not Halloween, but Christmas or this, this. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yes, just, we, we, just have, we have the Halloween town. Stay tuned. You can only stitch so much. So just stitch that Halloween town. And by the time you yes, do that, and, we'll and have something else out. That, that, that's there. Stop. Oh my gosh. Stop. <laughs> I'm not touchy right now. I just, I'm, She's I just, a little needy pants. I'm a little crusty. Piper, <laughs> you're going on a trip. Do you want to go to the farm? You're you want to go for a, a ride? We are having Mexican tonight. <laughs> I said I just want some good food that I don't have to cook and I don't have to clean up the dishes. Cashew's eating baby pasta. That's it. I didn't tell you last night. There was an open thing and I said, show me what you want me to cook you. So he takes out the box of pasta and goes like this because he thought it was not sealed. He thought it was sealed and that baby pasta, you know, went everywhere. Uh, everywhere. And he was just like, oh, can I leave it? I'll just leave it. Okay, that's all I have for this week. That's when you call the chickens inside. <laughs> right. All right. This Lunch. week in the Etsy shop, we had... Um, you have them. We started Presley. with uh, Joy, right? This was called Joy? Mm -hmm. Joy. Then we had the Santa sleigh. Okay. And these are all finished as an ornament. We have a tutorial in our... Uh, on our YouTube playlist, these but these beads are from the Amazon shop. I just went in and added a bunch more as well. This yes, two days ago. Um, also, different I, I colors asked, and stuff. Um, Chelsea to add these um, jack o' lantern lights. lights. That it's a string of jack o' lantern lights. They're so cute. I I have um, pictures taken of my hutch and my tear tray, so you can see them there, and they'll be on my blog in the next couple of days. Um, but there's uh. Also, the, there's a set of gingerbread lights, too, if you decorate for gingerbread. Yes. And then this week, we had uh, Mary Claus. So Santa and his missus are decorating the tree, and they have their old-fashioned vintage ornaments, and it's really cute, and I love the colors. This is Chelsea Checks in the Aqua. Makes it very vintage -y. This mm -hmm. is from Walmart, the, the little ornament section. So if your uh, Walmart has Christmas decorations up, you should grab a few. Then there, uh, this is the ribbon, Stitching with the Housewives ribbon in red. That is also in stock right now. Well, now, but not maybe by the time you see this. Okay, and then in Dapper Doodads, we have the Halloween Town. Yep. So there's that pedestal frame. The, okay, so she's here. <laughs> she's here. You got to drop a glue on this back here. Okay. How would I have gotten a drop of glue? Okay, can we put something on so it looks professional? What do you mean, how would I have gotten a drop of glue on it? You glued a pumpkin on it. <laughs> oh. All right, first we started with Boo. That's not it. That's, the, that's this week's. I know. First we started with Boo. Then we had um, Haunted House. Haunted House. A lot of you would have named it Haunted Mansion. As a tribute to Disney, I don't want to get sued. Um, so then, this week is um, Hillside Manor. Right? <laughs> Are you gonna show the letters? Okay, so this is done on the. Is it polka dots or paisleys first? Paisleys and polka dots. Paisleys and polka dots. Um, again, they are unfinished, but they're perfect for the dapper doodads. You could also put one on the back if you wanted to use it as double for a different season. You can paint it. These little doodads you can mm -hmm. buy separately. Chelsea's checks in orange and black and stitching stripes in black and white. Mm -hmm. And with each chart, you get two letters. So the H and the A came with the first one. The L and the O came with the second one. And I haven't finished the third, one, third one's letters. It'll be W and E. But I use those beads again from our Amazon shop and I've finished them on little pieces of sticky board and I've done orange, purple, orange, purple in our Chelsea's Checks fabric. I love that purple and black for Halloween. I, I so did a, a Chelsea job when I cut down the second one. I had like <sighs> less than an eighth of an inch oh, to wrap around frugal? it. Oh, you're being frugal? That's good. Because I don't <laughs> leave very much um, fabric around my stitching ever, and so I cut it pretty close. <laughs> it was bad. But my, I think it's so cute so far. My mark in the cross-stitch world is the fancy floss. Where's the, the thing? The thing. Oh. Again, so show we have thing. shown you two ways to finish this now. 
All right, so there'll be one more next week. And then it can be hung up. And this can either hang from the bottom or you can hang this someplace else. Or I think I, I wouldn't want it on the top because I wouldn't want it to hang down. But you could do it along the bottom. Just put some push pins or something in the bottom and attach it. Yeah, you could put it in this frame. There's a ledge right here. So you could even put the push pin in the back of the frame right here and have it mm -hmm. hang. Because then you wouldn't see the push pin. Mm -hmm. Um, but then you could remove it. But I think season. that this makes a really cute touch for it. Unfinished wood section at Hobby Lobby. She painted with a sponge brush and it's just some black paint. It's, There's always so many questions about this. I don't know why people can't find it. Uh, it's 7.87 inches by 0.98 inches by 29.92 inches. Whitewashed sign with frame 1607266. Again, you'll, if you're typing in that number, two sizes come up, you'll have to look at the I think it's a small, measurements. Does it, does it say small in there? It doesn't. That's what I'm telling them. They're going to have to look at the measurements. I just gave them the inches. They can compare the two. It's okay. always in the description. Okay. All right. That's what we have for um, our Etsy shop. Um, I thought yes. that since we got our things back from Fat Quarter Shop, we would show this is the fall oh, wow. adorables. And this little house was made by Stitch Etc. on Facebook. By the time you see this video as well, in the Etsy shop will also be the next um, month to month, which is November. November month to month will be in the Etsy shop. A lot of people are working on that. Yep. So that's the fall adorables. And then also, this is one of my favorites. <laughs> what? The, that one has so much controversy for the name. This is well, Welcome is Pumpkin or Bittersweet. It is. Not, I'm going to put the text message up on the screen about her naming it Welcome Pumpkin. Just so you know. What are you doing? Come <laughs> eating your furniture. Good thing she's going to Hunter's. <laughs> she's not eating my furniture. She hasn't eaten any furniture. She she's is. Rock. She No, she's a really good dog. She's smart, too. <laughs> she does high fives. My dogs can't do high fives. My dogs would run in front of a moving vehicle if I didn't <laughs> watch them. Okay, welcome, pumpkin. Beautiful colors. I've seen a lot of these stitched up this week as right, well. And a, a ton lot of, of you are sharing. Put, put them. their last names instead yep. of the Bittersweet Farm. I see you, crafty gals. I see you. Yep. Okay. What's next? All right. So I have a whip, but I can't really show you. So that's my whip. I got far, huh? Yeah. Thank you. I didn't show. <laughs> Yeah, I'm, I'm like <laughs> Anyway, um, two weeks ago we showed something. I get my eyebrows done today. And my eyebrows like they they're burning. Are they red? I'm, I probably look like a freak show. No, we both look <laughs> pale. Well, I am so pale because I'm so tired. But because of this box in our window, I hope you leave that up so the neighbors are like, "Did you see that? She's just putting boxes in her window. She couldn't even cut off the Amazon tape." <laughs> Thank God I got a big bag of dog food. Okay. Um, so we, so. we showed you a little sneak peek of what I was working on, and everybody yeah. was like, ah! I'm saving my winnings for what she showed them. <laughs> so we had gotten that box from... For the love of God. I know. She's just... <laughs> she knows she's going home with you. So anyway, we got that box from Paisley's and Polka Dots, and I told you I was going to use... How did that happen? We were going to use one for one of the designs, and that's what it was for. Ta-da! So this is hot cocoa. All right, so can you explain what is what? Okay, so this backing is from Paisley's and Polka Dots. This cup is from Hobby Lobby. So the backing comes with the Santa. Yes. Yeah. It's, I think it's called Dear Santa. Or Letters to Santa. Or Letters to Santa. This little hot chocolate sign is from Hobby Lobby. The, the bottle brush trees are from Hobby Lobby. This little spoon is an ornament from Hobby Lobby. Um, the, the candy cane and the greenery are from Hobby Lobby. The little wreath is from Hobby Lobby. So it's a lot of Hobby Lobby and then paisleys and polka dots. Get a close up there. Okay, so this will look so cute if you did a vignette with this and Jingle Bell Cafe. Yes. So again, your stores Claus, don't have information Mrs. Claus yet. Bakery. Your stores don't have information yet. Right. So what I was thinking is maybe I should do because we won't be sending out information until after next week. Whenever, yeah. So should I just start putting this stuff on my blog so that stores can show 
they, they could go to my blog and get the pictures if they want to show it early to get orders. Yeah. All right, so I'll probably do that. I'll put the pictures on my blog, and then if you want to take pre-orders you, in your shop, you can go to my blog and get them. Or you can tell your shop that you want this. But I told Chelsea, I'm like, well, I look at it, and maybe I did a little bit too much, but I love it. <laughs> so You could always do less mm -hmm. if that's your style. Yes. Uh, what size is that? Could Five by go, seven. So it could go on one of those canisters, too, if you wanted yes. to put your hot cocoa yes. in or... You could do a little vignette with a jar of marshmallows and stuff. That would be super cute, too. Okay. Love it. So that's that. And then we showed you a sneak peek of this, this last dog. week. Look at her. She won't want to leave the farm. Oh. So this is the January month to month. Be careful with the bottom. I don't know if I didn't get the magnets on right. But this is the January month to month, and I did use those new sticky circles from Fat Quarter Shop for the center, and it was so much easier. I do three layers of batting on mine to make it puffy, um, and I did put batting on this. But it's all done in blues and cream and the snowman and the black, and it's just really pretty. This uses that new Lou color too, right? Summer Sky? Yep. Summer Sky. There's a new color Colorworks. from Classic Color Works called Summer Sky, and that's involved in this um i used the stitching stripes in the white and the black and then i used the chelsea's checks in the blue and white not the aqua the blue did you say where you got the blueberries and stuff from this these are two picks from hobby lobby and i did just get them and these snowballs are also from hobby lobby and i did just get them so it's all fresh stuff and the ribbon is our stitching with the house size ribbon yep so then next week we'll show you our third release and um yeah we'll let you know because we have to figure out the shipping schedule and everything with us going away that weekend mm -hmm. we after um this retreat we have the one in Asheville, north carolina north carolina one of the carolinas uh yes okay uh this we we got this okay so from fat quarter shop we got our floss fix so these are going to be giveaways today the floss fix this month is beautiful uh gunmetal grays oh, wow. uh so tabby lunar lunar eclipse plymouth rock cauldron zach black and black coffee really pretty then we got a gift did you um did you see on Instagram that that Darby's mom posted her pumpkin picking day? She finished it. Mm -mm. Yeah, it's really pretty. We did see that we were featured in the Kenosha. New, what well, is it? We were. <laughs> you were. I took the picture though. <laughs> Me and Hunter. They, they asked for my pictures. You, Hunter, and Cash. Yes. They asked for my uh, pictures, so I sent them to them. We the wouldn't have even farm. known that if somebody didn't put it in our group. Mom was like, where did you find this? If somebody posted it, I had no <laughs> idea. Um, okay, so the Plaid Moose Carving Studio sent us these. And we had received some of these from the um, retreat mm -hmm. in and it's Indiana. Still Is it behind me? Yes. But I don't, I don't know schools. if it's the same person. I mean, they have, look identical. We I have just two of them for a giveaway. And we each get oh, we to keep to one. Give them away. Yeah, two of okay. them we're giving away. Mm. <laughs> All right, so, but I just want to show them up close. They are carved out of spools. They are super cute. Their website, um, they're on Facebook. The Plaid Moose Carving Studio on Facebook. So I'll just put that down below. So we we will maybe give these away. Um, <laughs> they have it. Can you stop this? Yep. All right. She had to yell at Presley. Um, okay. So she was upstairs chasing the cat. But I can hear this. <laughs> Eat in the bed. From Creative Carol, we got some more of these. I am in love with these. Um, any kind of folder-ish for my projects, I'm super excited about. So I use this religiously now. Um, these and then the ones from Amanda Badger I use mm -hmm. all the time. Um, so I use it for my weekly stuff. It has two pockets, one on each side. And I'm able to, like, once I'm done with my floss for the tear tray tidbits, I put it in one of these pockets and I load up my other threads for like the dapper doodads uh so she did a halloween theme so we will be sending these out as giveaways this week too with the 
tools. Um, okay, so we had giveaways last week. The Housewives Hurrahs. We picked some winners for that. Thank you so much for sharing. So you get $20 to our Etsy shop. And you just, if you want to hold on to it, you can. If you want to spend $10, what, you know the drill. Uh, oh <laughs> Jen Tracy, Linda Boudreaux, and, Boudreaux, sorry. Boudreaux. Boudreaux and Mary Miller. So I'm sorry. Uh, okay, and then we had tier tray tidbits. We love seeing all of your finishing. I think for next week's video, I'm going to go to the month to month. If you want to share a month to month, then we'll pick a couple from there because so many of you are keeping oh, yeah, up. So yeah, you yeah. can get um, the January once it comes out, which would be in a few weeks. Um, you would get that one as well. Oh, but if you're in the club, then I can send you something different. I hit my funny bone. Andrea <laughs> Hopman, Kelly Orf Elkins, and Mercedes w Wooten. Wooten. Woot, woot, woot. Mom watched The Watcher this week. I started to watch it and then I got too scared. So then I had to watch it during the day. <laughs> I started it. I thought it was cheesy the first episode. So I went to the center and now I'm going to go back to The Watcher. They, I, I saw a bunch of stuff though that like the people didn't even really move into that house. That they sold it before they even moved in. So it's not really real? So Aww. it is real. It is real. But th like and they still don't know who did it. And they said that they still don't. They don't know who did all that back then. Okay, well, now that you've watched that. that, you can watch Jeffrey Dahmer. I'm not watching Jeffrey Dahmer. <laughs> it went straight to that when I was done with that watcher, and I was like, ain't, <laughs> ain't no way. Um, Santa Slay, who was the first giveaway last week. No, uh, Celery. Santa Slay, Heaton One, Jerry R. Minchin, and Felicia Frakes. Then we had Haunted House. Mm -hmm. Put it on here so it looks professional. Dang it. <laughs> I'm on break. <laughs> I can't. Uh, Anne F. Struble, Aaron Martin, and Carrie William. Then we had from Fat Quarter Shop. Thank you, Kimberly and team. We are so excited about these. Dang it. I meant to bring my other one. I meant to bring the, the Jolly House size from last year to show you that this is a little bit smaller. Um, Christina McCaslin, Barbara Chase. You can just take my word for it. I'm pretty trustworthy. Most of them probably have it. So, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> then we had the bags from Earthwise Emporium. Thank you, Helen. Ellen? Ellen. Ellen Helms. Uh, these go to Betsy Albertson and Jeannie Monroe. Just hold that right here. Then we had... Uh, from Fat Quarter Shop. Thank you again, Kimberly and team. These are, I mean, these are amazing, uh, whole kit. So, I mean, if you get these, you've got everything you need to stitch it up. The first one is the sunflower bag. <laughs> Keep yourself together for five more minutes. <laughs> All right. This goes to early quilter and Sharon Robinson. Next we have the Halloween bag. I got to go like an auctioneer. Halloween bag goes to Marilyn Potal, Lisa Brooks. No. Congratulations. They won't understand you. Next, they don't either. Uh, any, <laughs> <laughs> the support group bag, Joyce Mills and Madonna K. Sweeney. Is that for if you have pumpkins? Yeah. Next, if you have, um, what is it? Ghoul's, Gar Ghoul's Garland. Oh, it's on the tree. Ghoul's Garland on the Halloween tree. You can see it there. Vicki Broom, Ellen Fuller, Kim Ray, Amanda Badger, and Cami Lee. I can't find it. <laughs> yeah, you really looked, Cash. When I was going to go find something in his room. Oh, I can't see it. I can't find it. And tell Hella goodnight. CNM Flowers, Luella Calkins, Lisa Gage, Corey Wood, and Stacy Gill. That's a PDF, so just email me what you won, and I'll send it to you. Thank you for your attention to this matter. Okay, this week in the giveaways, we've got... The beat, we've got the beat. Mary Claus. Number one is Mary Claus, three opportunities to win this digital file. Number two is three opportunities to win the Dapper Doodad. And you know that that comes with the letters to make the banner. Comes with the letters, that's number two. Three opportunities to win that. Number three from Fat Quarter Shop. Thank you, Kimberly and team. This is the... It's gray. <laughs> Gunmetal gray. <laughs> Classic color works. Two opportunities to win number three. Number four from Creative Carol on Etsy. Two opportunities to win the monster bag. Monster bags. 
Number four. No, well, they're not bags. Monster folders. Number five is two opportunities to win a thread spool, and I'm going to throw in a Christmassy check. It's number five. Number six. I'm, um, I'm going to do PDFs, yeah. The, this one and the, the pumpkin. Number six is three opportunities to win Hello Fall. The Fall Adorables. Whoops. Number six, Fall Adorables. And number seven, three opportunities to win Welcome Pumpkin. Welcome Pumpkin, Bittersweet Farm, whatever you want to call it. Okay, how are they going to win? So, you got the beat. Wouldn't you think my collection's complete? <laughs> Walmart, she got it there. It looks kind of vintagey, right? And mm -hmm. it, it, uh... Okay, okay, go. There, there's like every season in this house because I was taking pictures of the the snowman type things, the Christmas things, the the fall is still up plus the Halloween. It's like all of it. Right now is a great time to do a tour. Just get it all out one at a time. <laughs> I put a Christmas tree up two days ago. In your room? No, in the front room. He went outside to see if that guy was going to chill up the back, and I put it up real quick with cash, and I said, shh, don't say anything. And he walks in. Look what we did! Ta-da! <laughs> <laughs> I left for five minutes. What did you do? I said, I put up a tree. I don't want to hear about it. <laughs> I'm in between seasons right now. Okay, what do you want them to answer? When do you start decorating for Christmas? Oh, yeah. I know a lot of people that start in September. So, like Hobby Lobby. <laughs> <laughs> like the video. Be a subscriber. And tell us, when do you start decorating for Christmas? We want to know the exact day, hour, time, what you're wearing. You're, the only acceptable outfit is your Jolly Housewives right. shirt, of right. course. Cranked up Mariah Carey, or listen to us if you want to. Our voices are pretty beautiful. And um, that's it. Sipping out of a Ray Dunn mug. Mm -hmm. Did you get any cool Ray Dunn this week? No. Oh. I haven't been anywhere. Me either. I remember somebody stole my debit card. <laughs> and it took two weeks to get it. It was annoying. Mine only took four days, but still, it's annoying. She was smart enough after she learned my lesson to ask them to overnight it or express it, whatever. Okay. We've talked enough. See you later. Answer the question <laughs> when you start decorating. Be a subscriber, like the video, and then list out the numbers that you're interested in winning. If I messed up the numbers, just do the right ones and I'll fix it once. And that is I Piper with the. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> That's the turkey call. She's yeah. telling Celery to leave her alone. <laughs> Don't touch me. So follow us on Instagram at Priscilla Blade at Chelsea 356. And I should have some good Instagram pictures. I'm going to a mansion in the mountains. <laughs> I'm sitting on my couch for the 14th day in a row. I mean, it is pretty relaxed. I, I was able to stitch quite a bit this week. In just a few days, I was able to stitch a lot. Now my hand's broken, but we're okay. Okay, anyway, so, she should have pretty, I don't want to hear that she's all alone in the mountains. She's okay. She'll be fine. I'm, I'm nervous about going. I don't know why. I'm just nervous. Because somebody will, you probably are nervous about the flight. You always get something happening on the flight. <laughs> well, like yeah, because I looked at my ticket and mm -hmm. I'm in row 23. I never sit that far back. <laughs> <laughs> I like to be up in the front. Okay, then you can pay that much more to be up in the front. No, but like, She's like, can you change it? I'm in a middle seat. And I look at the plane. I'm like, there's no middle seat. This is just like five passenger plane. But it was a direct she, flight. Like, or, else she'd, get rid of me. or else she'd have to get off 17 times. So at least I got her a direct flight. And I got it in the time ranges that she wanted to. The uh, The flight home is only like 59 minutes or something like that. No, it's two hours. But with the time change, it's like an hour. Right. 59 minutes. It's perfect. It's magic is what it is. Anyway, it's going to take me a half an hour. Always something. The the like, you never do anything right. <laughs> Oh, it is not going to take you. Maybe with all your bags. She always tries to sneak in extra bags. You want to know why she has all that bad luck? Because she sneaks in 72 bags. Bag inside a bag inside a bag. I have to bring my stuff up. <laughs> anyway. Jeffrey. Wasn't it Jeff? Who? Jeff. Oh, the, the guy, guy laying on the floor. Yeah. <laughs> Again? About Jeffrey Dahmer. And I'm like, oh, God. <laughs> no. Moved on. 
So if you're going to the retreat, I'm excited to meet you. And I haven't heard from anybody that said, oh, I'm going. Take care of her. Did you do Starbucks? Is it close? Are you bringing your own tea? I think I'm out in the middle of nowhere. <laughs> oh. <laughs> they have um, low tea? High tea. High tea. High tea. Noon tea. <laughs> they it's, feed you at this retreat. It's very fancy. She's mm -hmm. excited. They have hand rubbers. Chelsea don't they? said you should probably bring some better clothes to wear for <laughs> dinner. This, I'm like, I don't have anything, so I'm wearing jeans. All I heard for my wedding was, I bought a nice top. I'm changing after the pictures. I took it <laughs> Didn't you wear it? No. Oh, you never changed. I never changed. She's, I'm getting into cover. If you can change into a short dress, I'm getting into jeans. I'll buy new <laughs> jeans if I have to, but I bought a rhinestone shirt and I'm wearing it. And I never went and changed. I can't believe that. She wore her jacket. It was too far to walk. <laughs> it was. <laughs> we kept them secluded. All right, we got to go. Anyway, Get so follow us on Instagram. Like I said, I'm hoping to have really good pictures. And so we have a, a special retreat piece that they'll be finishing on Saturday. And the good thing is that we get to sell it on the next Saturday. So if you love it, then we'll be selling it. Right. And you will love it because it's good. <laughs> <laughs> I stitched it. All right. We'll see you next week. Can I finish? You did the at Priscilla at Chelsea blog No, spot. I didn't say if you get your oh. finishing inspiration from us, tag us, tag my blog. We'd love to see your projects. Are you going to take care of my dog? <laughs> I don't know. She might be out in the outside kennel. She's looking at me. She's going to be fine. She's going to be fine. Cash drops more food on the floor than she'll know what to yeah, do with. Yeah, but she can't eat all that stuff because she'll end up having the... He can't eat anything. anything right now. She can't have a little bit of jello and pasta. Yeah, but it might make her not be able to go to the bathroom. And then she'll have a hernia. And then we'll oh, be back at the bed again. This dog. She's needy. Okay. We'll she's see so you tiny. next time. Oh, so... Um, what was I going to say? Did we do the... We did the tear tray tidbits? Okay. All right, well, that's all that. I'm just waiting. <laughs> just making sure you're done this time. We'll see you next time. <laughs> yep, and hopefully there won't be a box in the window. It and when we when we go to... Stop. <laughs> it's like seeing the basement. <laughs> it's not. I don't have boxes in the window in the basement. You should. So nobody can see down there. You should. <laughs> Hey, yours isn't the greatest either. Your garage looks like my basement. My garage okay. is so bad. Yesterday I pulled in everything from the garage. To walk through my basement to get to my house. Listen, there was a clear path. <laughs> there was a clear path and I left the lights on. Yeah. And probably Rupert to greet you. Yeah. <laughs> Just mm -hmm. think about my poor and dog walker. She's got this stupid witch on the porch that's like... <laughs> Making all this noise. She's and this I'm animatronic scared. thing that like really talks to I you. I didn't know where it. the noise was coming from. I thought, oh my God. <laughs> I was so horrors here. But it was just some witch. <laughs> on the the witch and the cats. <laughs> just <laughs> all the horrors. She had all the cats up on the counter. My cats I would never. I did not never. put the cats on the counter. The cats my all cats jumped on the counter. They were lined up like a. A feeding line. My cats would never. My cat would never because he can't jump that high. Oh my cat. All right, we'll see you next week. <laughs> Are you done? I'm done. Bye. All right, bye. bye.